during the first Occupied Warren opening, um, watching people um, look at my artwork, and it was honestly, it was like really touching to me. Um, Because it was the second time that installation was, because it was my thesis in college, and it had to do with all the cancer in my family. So it was a diff. When I had it up in Cleveland, it was different. It was all. It was more. I feel like the audience was different, but in Warren, I had a bunch. I had like real people coming up to me, looking at my artwork, and they would just start sobbing in front of me. So I had to deal with these women just sobbing, and they're talking about their um their sister who died of breast cancer and like, oh, my son died. And it was like all the, like people just like talking to me about all these deaths they had in their family. And it was hard because um, when I was doing all that research in my family, I had over 55 people on both sides of my family have cancer. So including my dad, my grandparents. So it was just amazing to watch all these people really connect. I It was more impactful being installed in Warren than it was in Cleveland.